The Prince and Princess of Wales are in Boston, where they're presenting awards for their Earthshot Prize. The awards were founded by the couple and aimed to find solutions to problems facing the planet. But they've been overshadowed by royal drama. Our royal correspondent, Daniela Ralph, reports. Meeting the people of Boston. It's what the Prince and Princess of Wales had wanted to focus on this week. It just hasn't been that easy. There have been plenty of distractions. Harry and Meghan, a love story is how it's been billed. The trailer for the six-part series on Netflix released right in the middle of William and Catherine's trip to America. I had to do everything I could to protect my family. The teaser hints at personal revelations. When the stakes are this high, doesn't it make more sense to hear our story from us? It's got people talking here, as has the racism row back in London. We all got to work together. We got to unite and stay together. Um, doesn't matter the black, white, Spanish, doesn't matter. We all got to work together and unite. For the trailer to come out, that was, that to me is backstabbing. Let everyone have their moment. And Kate, uh, Catherine and William right now, the Prince and Princess of Wales, have their moment here in Boston to make a change for the better. They've got around this city over the past two days, and it is the environment that remains a central theme of this visit. Today, attention shifts to what was always planned as the main event of this trip to America and the Earthshot Prize Awards ceremony. Of all Prince William's public work, Earthshot is now firmly established as one of his most important projects. Get ready to join me and special guests for a unique event as we come together to celebrate those with the solutions to repair our planet. The five winners will be announced this evening. Each one wins a million pounds for their innovative environmental idea. As they head into the final day of this trip, the Prince and Princess of Wales will meet President Biden, who will also be in Boston today. It's been a visit to America filled with some unexpected challenges. Daniela Ralph, BBC News, Boston.